My mother was diagnosed with stomach cancer on October 2007. And at the hospital, we discussed, and the doctor, the doctor said it was stage four. Cancer um, surgery was not an option. And my mother wanted comfort care. She did not want to go through any pain and suffering. And so we discussed hospice program with her. And she was given the choice between Kaiser Hospice and Self-Help Hospice. And my mother chose Self-Help Hospice because of the bilingual and bicultural uh, experience where she spoke Cantonese and the staff spoke Cantonese and she would be able to express her problems, symptoms, and concerns to a bilingual, bicultural staff. And she had questions about what it is like at the end of life, you know, what suffering would she be going through, what would be some of the, you know, uh, and how to minimize that suffering. And the nurse was able to comfort her and reassure her in her own language and understanding the cultural um, background and answer her questions and was very supportive and caring. It was a very positive experience and my mom was so comfortable staying in her own home, familiar surroundings and surrounded by loved ones. We had relatives and friends who visited on a regular basis and she was very happy with that and comforted with that and at the hospital it, it would be more difficult and it was just very relaxing at home and um, the professional staff would with the expertise and the language were able to communicate the signs and symptoms approaching death how to prepare for it what to expect because usually we don't know what to expect and how to prepare for it so they would walk us through each step and guide us through each step. And there was follow-up bereavement um, counseling after that for one year. So, um, the staff kept in touch with me and asked throughout the year how I was doing living life without my mother. Yeah, And they showed their caring and support through that. Mm -hmm. And I was able to talk about my grieving process and, um, you know, and just talk about it and to talk about good memories with mom. Right. Um, it is a gift um, that um, people can give to their loved ones to keep them uh, in the comfort of their own home. And it's a gift to have the hospice staff come to the home without having to um, take her out to an office somewhere or uh, to be in unfamiliar surrounding because she is most comfortable at home and she lived in that home for more than 30 years and um, so that's a gift to be able to do that to have all the different disciplines come to the home the home health aide the social worker the chaplain the nurse uh, it was very beneficial